Welcome into Cooking the Light Way, presented by Tico People's Gas. Casey Phillips here with the general manager of the Buccaneers, Jason Light's wife, Blair Light, and the team chef for the Buccaneers, Chef Mike. So we are going to be cooking with natural gas here, something healthy. So tell us what this next recipe is. This one is a Korean duck taco. It's a very simple marinade. What we do is we're going to make the marinade and heat it at the same time. So while we're making it, we're going to want to keep the pan fairly low because we don't want it to really cook off. And that's good that you can actually see. That's what I love. You can tell yes. exactly yeah, you where you need it. Visually you can see it. everything. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to put just a tiny bit of oil in, not a lot, just so it keep everything from sticking. And then we're going to take some scallions or green onions, some ginger and garlic, and we're just going to kind of just get that to just start to cook, just lightly and. We're gonna add a little bit of rice wine vinegar, sesame oil. Now, sesame oil has a low smoke point, so you don't want the pan too hot, or it'll start smoking. But it gives right a lot away. of really nice flavor. And it's yeah. more for flavor than for Interesting. cooking. Interesting. And it looks like you didn't need very much of it at all. No, it, a little bit goes a long way. So you get the smell going, a little bit of odor. Yeah, it smells great. I like spicy. Yes, yes. <laughs> I so, can but see. just a little bit. A red pepper plate. Okay, I saw that. <laughs> no, 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 we're not going to do it all. Man, this smells incredible already. So you get the smell going, and many things with the Korean and Asian cooking, there's a balance in there. So we have a little bit of spicy. So we're going to have a little bit of sweet with some brown sugar. Ooh, that's an interesting idea. Another reason why you want to keep it low, so it doesn't caramelize. Doesn't caramelize. And then we're going to add the soy sauce. So soy sauce is a little bit of salt. So you see it's kind of light little bubble going. We're going to add our duck meat. So this is already cooked duck this, meat? This is a cooked duck meat. It's, kind of, it's like um, leg and thigh meat. Yeah. So Try all we're doing is just you know, warming it up. So I have some flour tortillas. Could you do Ooh. corn with this too? You or? can do corn yeah. tortillas. You can awesome. do any tortillas. Yeah, they're nice um, and warm. Some of the different things you can do is if you really want to make it more of the Korean duck taco, a little kimchi with it. Oh, yeah. Is very good. If you're like somebody's husband I know, sriracha in it is yeah, very good. Yeah, seedler or hot, any kind of hot sauce. Any kind of hot sauce I know is his thing. Take it a little hoisin sauce, spicy. which is considered an Asian barbecue. It's, it's a little salty sweet and too. sweet. You just spread a little on. Ooh. And that's where it comes down to, if you like the spicy, you put in you could add some cabbage on there yeah. too to give the a little cabbage crunch. Cabbage for some crunch, some red onions. And it's... Oh man, this looks awesome. It really does look good. You have your duck taco.